say, let's measure this thing. <laughs> well, I measure it again. Well, measure what six times and cut once. No, you just cut it wrong and then you redo it. Three fifty. That looks good. Math looks good. Mm. For once. Mm. We're just off a little bit. That's what they make welders for. <laughs> Be wide enough to put the hose in. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think that's a that's a chunk out. Yeah, I have to do a little welding now. No biggie. We're expecting errors anyway. Yeah. This will fit in there now. I bet. <laughs> Still a little, a little high. Still a little off. Still a little bit off. There is it. Oh, yeah, yeah. That should be tight. That should be tight. Rely on the gasket. See, we got some tranny right here, so I think we need to have an o ring stuck in this thing to get a better seal. Mm. So, right now we're still off by at least another 40 or so, at least maybe 50. We're 50 up still. So we'll cut another 50. Okay, so we'll do another 50. That side's good. All right, one more cut. All right, we'll come back when we get it done. All right. All right, we cut another 50 off. This one over here just bolts in back over here. Right. Success. This gives us more length too because you can go twist it. See? All right. 
could have got away with this gap being up a little higher on. And I'm not really worried about this either because we have to have a trough through here to get oil through anyway. Yep. Not too concerned about that. You don't. But I got a cut more here anyway. You don't think this should be maybe just a little bit higher? Do you want it to sit that low, or do you? Well, want I want it to be low like that, yeah. So right now the hose is a little on the short side, which is hurting us. Damn chip. Like so, this is flat. The hose will take a set like that. You can bend this hose that way. Yeah. It's just right now, it's so it's under tension. Yeah. I like I like to see this actually bolt down so it's not free floating like this too. I don't really like it being loose like this. You could very easily put a screw right in here to hold it. So it's actually physically held in place. Mm. Yeah, like I said, I don't know if the gasket covers this area or not. Because you have to have some kind of seal between here and the tranny where it sucks the oil through or it won't suck oil. So I might want to put a screw in here just to make it that do that. It really needs to have one in there. That would hold it correctly. Alright, that's closer. This one here, we will probably remake this one. It's, the hose is actually right into where the pin is. So. That has to be remade. Yep. No way of getting around that one. So either I gotta remake it or you should make a new one from scratch. So let's make one from scratch. So I think we need to do a little bit of redesign work on this one. Maybe they can make one for us correctly, just kind of straight out and yep. then we'll redesign this. We'll put a big hole right through here and it'll go through it'll just feed through a big hole in the center of this, which yeah. will allow the oil from here to there. Right. And then I'll trough it over here better. But anyway, for now, that's kind of what it's going to look like. So I need a little bit of work. So I don't like this being loose. So I'm going to do some, we'll do some work on this. We'll see him Tuesday or Wednesday and see what, uh, what they can do for us. Okay. All right.